kusaidia mtu ambaye ame affectiwa na HIV and AIDS in any mm. way mm. Uh, in one way or the other mm. they can either make or break mm. when you are working with um, the ladies that you work with mm. and their families mm. how do you even talk to the families that they have immediate mm. and both extended that mm. are willing to be part of this journey mm. to help these ladies be able to continue moving on and especially looking at conversations mm. about mental health mm. Mm. yeah um, uh, the approach for me was forgiveness mm -hmm. uh, when we started the program a lot had happened people had been hurt by their friends by their families people had been abandoned but I felt if people have to heal they have to start from a point of forgiveness mm -hmm. so my message was wacha kwanza tusamehe watu let's forgive people then we move from there we take care of ourselves we look at why did people judge us kwanini watu wali to judge kwanini people felt that uh, we do not deserve to be relatives yes. then to asamehe then we will be able to reach out to them so that is where we started. The, uh, we have a whole six months mm -hmm. of, uh, of psycho, we call it psychosocial healing. Mm -hmm. And in psychosocial healing, all we talk about are issues of taking care of ourselves, our mentors, including forgiving people. Okay. And in the next, which is empowerment, yes. in, after the six months, you get another six which is empowerment. Mm -hmm. In empowerment, it involves us going to the people that we have forgiven. Mm -hmm. Be it be husbands, when we watch our mama and our toto. Be it be relatives that kicked you out. Be it be neighbors that have talked ill about you. Going back to them. And you're going back to them in a point where you are empowered. You have accepted yourself mm -hmm. because a lot of times it, it comes from also self stigma. I have not forgiven myself. So at a vile utaniangalia, utasema tu ya mesema nikona virusi. You already vile, judge yourself. Uh, you have already judged yourself. Mm -hmm. So by the time you're going to people, you have already accepted yourself. You have no issues. So you are able to discuss and to reach out. And a number of people have reunited with their families. Families love their people. Because you're empowered, your children are going to school. Yes. You have your own businesses. Because again, um, the message that came through is uh, people are going to die. Mm. Now what to watatuachia watoto. Mm. Now watoto watakuwa dependents. So you're being kicked out so that ukikufa watoto wako wasikuja kutusumbua. So now na. So when you're coming back and you look empowered, you look yes. like anybody else. You're taking care of your children. Your mm. children are in school. You have your business. I mean, people are it's easier for people to accept you and to look at you as one of them. And it